EU's Brexit sabotage plot, Macron ally confirms plan for MEPs to improve Boris deal. A strong ally of French President Emmanuel Macron and leading voice in the European Parliament has confirmed plans for MEPs to modify the Brexit deal. French MEP Nathalie Loiseau, who is a strong ally of Emmanuel Macron, has confirmed a plan to modify the Brexit deal, insisting the European Parliament will improve the agreement. Ms Loiseau agreed that MEPs have a role in modifying the agreement. This comes as the Brexit deal, agreed on Christmas Eve, has yet to be legally ratified by the European Parliament. France 24 host Catherine Nicholson asked, the deal has been provisionally applied since January 1, but it hasn't yet been ratified by the European Parliament. It is a key legal step, but does the European Parliament have a real say here? I mean, if you and your MEP colleagues find things you don't like, you can't really change them now, can you? Ms Loiseau responded, it's a question of political responsibility. Do we want to ruin the whole thing and say there shouldn't be a deal after all? She hit out at the British Parliament, which passed the Brexit agreement after a day of discussion. France's former Europe minister said, I'm certain we will act responsibly. But that means we go through the text. We don't vote on it within 24 hours, as the case was in Westminster, which was quite a surprise to me. If you see that things are lacking, or things should be more precise or should be improved you say it. Ms Nicholson asked, so you think MEPs could have a role in modifying the agreement, even though the deal is already in force? The MEP responded, of course. If we consider that the deal is not perfect, we will be very careful about its implementation, we will monitor that. And in the future, if things are to be improved or complemented we will say that. Earlier in the interview, Ms Loizo called the agreement damage control adding that it's time for reality. She also called for a fully-fledged treaty on security and defense, saying, we are facing the same threats, the same challenges. We have to work together.